Well, one of the most difficult issues with the Mike Rinder saga is the alleged cancer he's suffering from. And some people raise, isn't it very cruel for us to um, be attacking a cancer victim? But here's the thing. Is Mike Rinder suffering from cancer? That is actually not very clear. His last two PET scans have been completely cancer-free. Mike Rinder never had cancerous tumors in his body. He had fluid that was accumulating in his lungs. The fluid was testing positive for cancer. After many, many, many tests, well, Aaron says a little bit more, but basically the gist is that he had a mutation and people thought he had cancer. In other words, it could be Render honestly thought he had cancer, but it was a panic. Don't worry, he will be fine. But here's the problem. Even if he does not have cancer, I mean, there are questions here. He raised the money. And again, this is factual. Aaron raised money for him. And it could have been a lie. It could be an honest mistake. It could be a lie. Why is this relevant beyond the Aftermath Foundation kind of drama? Well, this is a legal issue. Because you see, Mike Render, as he usually does, went way too far. He declared in the lawsuit against Miscavige in the church that, yes, he does have cancer. And yet, if you take a look at Mike Render's statement in the Leah Remini sworn affidavit to the Leah Remini lawsuit. He said it should be noted, and this is under oath. That's right. He actually officially declared, legally, I have cancer. I swear, if I lie, I'm committing perjuries. Well, yeah, that's the problem. He might have committed perjury because at this point, Mike seems just fine. Oh, don't worry. He's still taking money for cancer. In fact, recently, he actually showed off vacation photos declaring that oh this nice foundation is treating me very well but we had to go to dc and i was happy to do that so yes mike render emmy winner is on charity original location to distant parts of the body it's sometimes referred to as metastatic cancer this stage may, may be diagnosed years after the initial cancer so he's taking donations for the alleged cancer He's making all this money from the podcast, the Emmy, the show, you name it. All that. The book deal. Go through the whole thing. And, and, and he's on charity. But did he even have cancer? Don't know. Also don't care. The only relevant parties that might be an issue are his children. Oh, and don't worry. They're being paraded around a lot in these photos to garner sympathy for him. Best case scenario is he wasn't lying. It was an honest mistake. He can document the cancer, but he did exaggerate how sick he was, which is still pretty alarming. And we have to be honest, then Aaron likely knew he was exaggerating at the very best. Or it could be, worst case scenario, he was lying. He was lying about the whole thing, and Aaron knew he was lying. Didn't care. Still going to raise money. Falsely. And legally, he did perjure himself, which would create problems for the lawsuit. Now, we got to be honest, the lawsuit, I think, can do a lot of good. However, at the end of the day, even if certain people make hundreds of millions of dollars, right, for harassment, which I do think was well documented, will this stop the church? No. Will this stop Miscavige? No. It might help people by narrowing fair gaming and other tactics. So it still might do a lot of good pulling in things into the public domain, which the church once kept secret. So it could still do a lot of good. However, the primary purpose is, right, for a lawsuit to benefit the people in the lawsuit. So it's very tricky. And if Render lied, then that is going to damage the lawsuit. And that's just a typical tactic for Mike Render, is to hide behind other people. Oh, if you expose me as a liar, oh, what about the lawsuit? Oh no, what about the Aftermath TV show? What about my wife? What about my children? Well, Mike, you're guilty. That's your problem. It's not our problem. But yes, definitely his children are a tricky matter. But then we could just set up a fund for them. And that's about it. Maybe we should take care of them. That's about it. You're not involved. Your wife is not involved. She's an adult. I'm sure she's gotten a lot of good paychecks being next to you. Really, we need to stop this play acting. Again, whether he lied to us, don't know for sure. But it's a strong possibility. Did Aaron lie to us about the cancer? 
that's also a strong possibility. So I think the next step should be, we need to be very careful when people make these insane claims and say, okay, well, even if you are sick from cancer, I don't care. It's not my concern, not my responsibility. You have to handle that. That's your responsibility. That may be very cruel, but with the case of Mike Render, we want to err on the side of caution. 